What is a pap score? Pulmonary artery pressure testing in beef cattle is being used to identify animals that may be susceptible to brisket disease, a heart ailment usually occurring at altitudes above 5,500 feet. Let's take a closer look. Dr. Tim Holt is a veterinary and a longtime faculty member at Colorado State University. He spent a good portion of his life studying bovine high mountain disease, commonly called brisket disease, in beef cattle. Brisket disease causes high blood pressure, excess fluid in the chest cavity, and leads to congestive heart failure. It is evidenced by a swollen brisket, difficulty breathing, and usually results in death. Since 1980, Dr. Holt has pioneered the test to measure pulmonary artery pressure and has traveled the Mountain West testing thousands of cattle for seed stock producers in an effort to give cattlemen a tool to avoid susceptible genetics. The test is performed by inserting a catheter through the jugular vein, ending up in the pulmonary artery where a pressure reading is recorded. A PAP score of 41 or lower is thought to be suitable for most high-altitude producers. Dr. Holt will tell you that the PAP test is not the final answer to prevent brisket disease, but it is the best tool we have at the present. Here's something you may not know. Brisket disease is becoming common in feedlot animals, even at lower elevations in the Midwest. Speaking at a PAP workshop held at the National Western Stock Show, Dr. Holt told of a friend in Nebraska who runs a large feedlot. He stated that his number one cause of death in the feedlot right now is cardiac disease. Here's why. Researchers are finding that large-framed, high-growth animals pushed to heavier weights of 15 to 1,600 pounds do not have enough heart and lung capacity to service their circulatory system. A major issue is that the internal organs do not grow proportionate to the size of these feedlot giants. Add to that the effects of heat, dust, and fat deposits crowding the chest cavity, and it's no wonder they develop heart problems. For decades, Kit Pharaoh has been preaching moderation in all things, particularly frame size. While the status quo beef industry has been chasing more growth and carcass to appease the packers, PCC has been honing in on optimum size and performance to benefit the producers. Our moderate frame genetics have been proven to perform better in the cow pasture, in the feedlot, and on grass. Pharaoh Cattle Company has two cooperative producers who raise high-altitude cattle in the Rocky Mountains. These pap-tested bulls will sell at the Colorado Springs sale. You will find them in the catalog with a mountain logo next to their genetic information. You will also find moderate frame size, fertility, calving ease, low maintenance, and a one-year guarantee. I'll see you next time on the Herd Quitter Minute. (laughs) 